review time. All right, it's been a while since I've reviewed something. Uh, it's been a while since I've uploaded, actually. Sorry for that. Um, it's because I have big plans for stuff that I have to get working on. Sorry, if my hair is wet. I just took a shower and I didn't feel like drying it. So, uh, if you, if you're not blind, uh, you probably couldn't, even if you're not, even if you're blind, you probably couldn't see what I just threw. If you're not blind, you probably couldn't see what I just threw because, I don't know, I just threw it. So, we have bags. We have these new, you guys probably know what this is, if you can tell by the pattern. We have the new Hex Parts and Service plushies. Both of them, the new ones. Not the, not Wave 3, this is, yeah. We have both Hex Parts and Service Wave 2s. I didn't get Wave 1 because I didn't really want Wave 1. <laughs> uh, yeah, that, that's my excuse for not getting Wave 1. So, let's get into it. Oh my god, this, these are so, I was so hyped for these. I already opened them, but that's because, that's why I have both of these over here. You can't see what they are until I unbox the plush. Alright, who is this? No, I'll save you for last. I forgot who was in each bag, because I, again, I just threw them. So, first up. We have, ow, these things are heavy. So first up we have, let me assemble these. They come fully disassembled. So I, I made sure to repack them just how they, how I got them. So we have a <laughs> spring bunny here. This is the head, a bunch of different parts. Also QR code if you want to go to the website. Yeah, this is the head. It's pretty nice. The whiskers though are a little flimsy and they don't really hold their place, but you can just fix them to make them look better. So yeah, he even has the uh, green eyes that Spring Bonnie is known to have, which is a really nice touch. Next up, we got the body. So yeah, the body is just, yeah, it's just a typical Spring Bonnie body. We also have the little buttons on the chest, which is just a typical color. And even we have the little bunny tail. It's not detachable, it's fixed onto there. And the bow tie is also fixed, which sucks. If you get a detachable bow tie, that would be awesome. But I don't know how they do that. I, I, if you couldn't tell, I'm not really that high energy. I wanted to, but I'm sick. If I told you what I'm sick with, I'd get monetized. Uh, for future me that has monetization. And next up we have the arms. Just typical little magnetic arms are very poseable. You could just, yeah, little, little arms. I love this. It's so nice having the, uh, having posability and I could just like, I could just pick it up, just throw the arm if I wanted to, but I'm not. These are very expensive. <laughs> extremely, extremely expensive. Then we have the, look, watch, watch, watch. You could just trick shot. You could just trick shot them on there. It's really nice. So we have spring body here, full body. There we go. We have legs as well. So these are just what you'd expect. And then we also have the pizza cutter that comes with. It was originally gonna come with a knife, but they had to change it for legal reasons. Oh, yeah, also, let's look at the bag. So here's the bag. It has all four original Wave 1s on there. And you can kind of... And they also... This is a special bag because... Freddy... Uh, Freddy and Bonnie's bow tie and hat are colored purple. For the... Because here they do... They are purple. So these are the limited edition bags just for this. It, it's honestly really nice. I'm glad that they did that. They didn't have to do that, but they did. And we also have the card that goes along with Spring Bonnie. I really like this art. This art is so nice. It's so, oh my God. This is such good art. Cause look, you can literally see 
picturing Bonnie holding the pizza cutter like he does in real life. It looks just like the plushie. Yeah, and then if you look on the shadow, it literally shows purple guy because Spring Bonnie, I mean, purple guy's probably inside the Spring Bonnie outfit because I don't think that Spring Bonnie would naturally hold a pizza cutter. I mean, it's still a good weapon, but <laughs> yeah, that was uh, Spring Bonnie. It's very, this is a surprisingly big plush. It's very big. I love it so much. Oh, I'm so excited for wave three. All right, next up we have, oh, this is gonna hurt. Oh, there they go. All right, let me get, let me grab this piece. Oh my God, all the pieces are falling. Damn, it's a lot, I have so many parts here. So we have, perfect. Here's his little head. And now when I look at this, I feel like this is gonna be not soft. It's gonna be the typical, ugh, gross little, ugh, the gross, uh, like, what is it? Like freaking teddy bear material that I don't like. But yeah, this is actually extremely soft material. Same with um, Spring Bonnie, which is really nice. So yeah, here's the head. He has a nice little hat. The eyes are a bit off on mine, but that's just mine. It gave it gives some personality. And he has a big little boop nose. Someone could probably mod in freaking it to make honk sound. You press it. Yeah, here it is. And I also like the embroidery, which is actually purple instead of black. It's honestly, this is just so nice. It, I also have here. QR code on the tag if you want it. Next up, we have the bot. Oh! <laughs> Almost lost in there. <laughs> so yeah, we have the, the, the body. Now you might think, it's just the same as Spring Bonnie. Actually, if I grab Spring Bonnie's body, just not the same. So, here is Fredbear's body, here's Spring Bonnie's body. Now, the obvious difference is the material used on Fredbear, but if you turn them around, Fredbear actually has a different tail than Spring Bonnie, so it's always fun. And uh, all the Spring Bonnie parts are everywhere. Let's get it back together, buddy. Uh, we'll do some monstrosities with these later. But for right now, let's stick to uh, actually talking about the plushies themselves and not making monstrosities. We'll get to those when we have all of the plushies talked about. Yeah, here is Fredbear. That's what we have so far, Fredbear. You can make some awesome things with this. I keep dropping the leg. All right, so next up we have both of Fred Bear's arms. Oh. Now he, yep, and the arms are almost the same as Spring Bonnie, but they do have a bit of differences. So, um, let me grab the other arm of Fred Bear so that I can do a direct comparison. So. We have Fred Bear's left arm and Spring Bonnie's right arm, left arm. So, obvious differences. Again, the material. <laughs> Wait, why can you do that? I don't think you're supposed to be able to do that, but whatever. So yeah, here we, here we have them. Um, and obviously, the Fred Bear has claws. Also, his arm is a bit meatier on than Spring Bonnie's, but I think that might be an error. But, there we go. So next up, let me put give, let me put your arm back on. There we go. Leg one, leg two. So next up, we have the legs. Now it's probably the, it's the same difference as the claws, but yeah, the legs also have claws, and the underneath is the same. The only difference is the texture. Again, also, yeah, the the beans on the on the arms are the same. Same beans. And finally, we have the walkie-talkie that Fredbear comes with. 
So that it comes with old walkie-talkie as a reference to Sister Location, where he did, or there was a Fredbear plush that did hold a walkie-talkie, which was nice. That was a good touch. That instead of giving him just like a microphone like Freddy, giving him some uh, a bit of differentiating between Freddy and Fredbear. So it's not just a recolor, but that's it's still basically what it is. Yeah, the uh, yeah, here's the walkie-talkie. Just the same walkie-talkie from this location. It's really nice. All right, now here's the card for Fredbear. The, and this is exactly what I was just talking about. That's the sister location office from Custom Night that has Fredbear holding a walkie-talkie. It's awesome. I like that they added those touches. So, now, the main point of these. You can, so as you probably know, these are magnetic. So, I can just rip them, oh crap, I got hit in the eye. So yeah, you could just rip them apart. So you don't, so, and say I get freaking the arms back on. So, say I wanted Fredbear to hold Spring Bonnie's pizza cutter. There you go. You could have him hold Spring Bonnie's pizza cutter. And, that's why I think it's always good to get multiple instead of just one. So then you can have a bunch of customization. So let's make a monstrosity. So I'm going to take all these guys apart. So you could do anything with these. So for now I'm going to keep it pretty, pretty basic. All right, here we go. This is, good. <laughs> this is not going to seem basic, but yeah, for Wackiness standards. This is pretty standard. Yep. Here we go. So we just we could just do this if we wanted to. I mean, or I could just put the head on the arm. Make the hand hold the leg. Like that. Yeah, you can just create wacky monstrosities like this. Or I can put the leg on the head. Make the hand. Yeah, you could just make stuff like this. It's it's insane. Now, say I wanted to start mix and matching. I could put the pizza cutter on this limb. See? Voila. Or I could, say, grab Spring Bonnie's head and put it right there. See? You get all, all this customization. Now, the issue with these two, like the same color. So you can't really make as many combinations as the first four because of the, they're the same color. All you can do is change the, um, like the texture and stuff, which is all right, I guess. Now, uh, I mean, they also do have different like bodies, different heads and different accessories, but that's about it. Like all of these limbs are the same. Now, I know you all want me to do this. It's gonna hurt too. I'm gonna do it with Fredbear. Uh, just because I spring body looks a lot more delicate than Fredbear. So I'm gonna do it with Fredbear. I, I really don't want to, but I'm going to. Of course, there we go. Here we go. Let me assemble Fredbear. This is this is hurting. I know I don't want to do this, but I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna leave the walkie talkie here because I don't want that to break. So, I know what you guys want me to do. I'm here, ready? The magnets are decently strong. The arm stayed on. That's about it. But yeah. Uh, don't do that. 
these are very expensive. I do it for entertainment purposes only. See, he's perfectly fine. But, might not end out the same way. Fears. But, they're still really nice. Now, I have a few more issues with these lovely plushies. Now, I love them. Don't get me wrong, I love these plushies so much. They're so nice. But, my issue is their price. These things sit at $50 each. So just one costs $50. I got the bundle. That's $100 for two little plushies. Don't get me wrong, they're pretty much worth it because they're amazing, they're nice and soft, but for kids, these really aren't a kid's product because they're definitely a lot more for collectors. These are very fragile, you can't really snuggle with them at, at night because if you wanted to, they're, you'd probably just end up losing all your parts. So they're really more for display purposes. And it's just having fun. They're not really bedtime toys. They're definitely collector's items. Now, th these aren't the only ones we have. Fred Bear, Spring Bunny, Freddy, Foxy Bunny, and Chica. Those are all the ones that are out right now that you can buy. But there's also gonna be wave three, which has, I think it's, Toy Freddy, Toy Bonnie, Toy Chica, and Balloon Boy. Mangle comes out a little bit after that. But yeah, these are these beautiful, they're beautiful, I love them. Now I'm gonna use Spring Bonnie's body as a base and make another monstrosity. So this one's not gonna be as bad. I'm just gonna flip him upside down. Yep, I'm just turning him, him upside down. It's not gonna be that hard, is it? It might be, hold on. How am I gonna do this? This is gonna be hard. Wait, can I get legs, right? I can give legs to the heads? No, no way. No way. This is so cursed. Look at this, it's like Moongle. It's Moongle, bro. This is awesome, I love these. Um, what else can I do? Pizza cutter, I can just put it right there. <laughs> hmm, I get the body, right? How long can I make, wait, so I could put that there that there, maybe? Oh, right there, right there, right there. Um, put that there, and give me Fred Bear's arms as well. So I'm just gonna make an arm, an ultra arm. This thing, it's beautiful and I love him. This is Ultra Arm Spring Bonnie. <laughs> He's so <laughs> wacky. Like, the possibilities are endless. Wait, can I make a spider? I'm gonna try and make a spider. Hold on. I'm having so much fun with these. Spider Spring Bonnie. Spider Spring Bonnie. Something like that. No. Can I do this? No way. No way. That kind of looks normal. Wait, can I do this? Maybe? That is weird. That is really weird. 
Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. What is this? This is horrible. I mean, how many? <laughs> this is just insane. I don't. I don't even know. Oh. <laughs> There's so many possibilities. Can I get two heads and stick them together? No. I can stick on a walkie talkie. Um, yeah, I think I can do this, that, put this here. Wait, no, I can put this here. So we'll have, wait, I think I've done this before, hold on. So arm, so <laughs> I'm having too much fun with this. So I could put Fredbear's head there, Spring Bonnie's head there. I could put Fredbear's leg here. No. Fredbear, you gotta stay on the body. Put that there. You can put this leg here. And you can put this arm grip. Put that there. Get the walkie talkie. Boom. Look at this. <laughs> this is so wrong. Bro, Hex, why did you let this let us do this? Oh my god. When Mangle comes out, we're gonna have so many magnets. Oh my god, that'll be awesome. But yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed me messing around with body parts for half the video. Uh <laughs> yeah. If you I'm gonna get these to where it's actually normal and we can look at them. I can give you guys uh, a look, see if you guys want to buy them or not, but I don't know if you guys will after this chaos that have ensued, and also their price, but yeah. Yep, Fred Bear, you're gonna go there. No, I'm not gonna do this. Am I? Am I gonna be able to do this? Is Fred Bear on my shoulder? I can. Damn. Boom. All right, so here we go. Fred Bear and Spring Bonnie. Yep, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, please like, comment, subscribe. Look at these. Oh, I love them. They're so cute. Yeah, like, comment, subscribe. And yep, I hope you guys, uh, oh, wait. Hex responded. Oh my God, Toy Chica will have a detachable beak. Let's go. Oh, <laughs> that'll be awesome. All right, yeah, uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Uh, yeah, I love these. They're so cool. I love them. Oh my God, these are my favorite plushies. But yeah, see you guys in the next video. Uh, that should be, um, yeah, I have a, f a few really big plans, like comedy videos, come with some comedy skits, and a little presentation that I have to show off. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. See you guys next time.